Hey everyone, welcome back to Subnautica. So, not too much has changed since last episode. We've got the little uh, bioreactor running. You can just throw sort of anything in it. And um, it uh, uses it to create power, which is cool. Uh, I've got this room scanning for wrecks and I've just driven one of the cameras over to a nearby wreck so I thought we'd go and check out the wreck now let's see here apparently there is a panel on the seamoth where I can put the upgrades in I just don't know where it is So I can't see it anywhere, I'm... You guys know where it is, please, you know. You know. Let's just... Welcome aboard, Captain. No, I didn't want to get back out. I wanted to... Do this for one second. So... Do you looking through my... Uh, through my uh, my comments here there's a panel on the left side of it need to hover over the right place thanks peter need to hover over the right place my left or your left <laughs> that's this panel here isn't it Ah, that's a Cyclops one. Do I still have my Seamoth upgrades? I don't think I do. But now that we know where it is, let's close that, jump back inside. Welcome aboard, Captain. Yeah, uh, Seamoth upgrade. So Seamoth depth module and okay, storage. I want to take that. There we go. Put the poster on the wall. Okay, so apparently that little panel should be able to put crush depth now 300 meters. Okay, so this thing can now go to 300 meters without being worried about getting crushed. Not the smartest move to be doing this at night. I just realised I need to uh, switch that window over there. That's fine. Sand shark. So there's this wreck over here. So there's a few things around. And a lot of sand sharks. A lot of sand sharks. I saw these few things around here. I kind of wish this thing had guns on it. I really do. So what I'm hoping is that uh, that should be five, one, two. We've got a propulsion cannon as well. So I've got the scanner. This fire reactor one. Ah! Oh, come on. I'm gonna hit him with this thing. So there's a little hatch here. Eh, it doesn't go anywhere though. I'm kinda hoping it did. 
That's right. No biggies. Scanner room fragment. Again, something I don't need. Fire reactor frank. Another thing I don't need. Well, that's unfortunate. The uh, oh no, he's still chasing me. This wreck doesn't have what I need to get, which is, you know. Be right if I can take the forklift. Screeches are very noisy. Well, this thing's shooting at it too. Look at that. There's a war going on. Um, so this little camera dude, I might just grab him. Push one, no. How do we oh, turn the lights off? Let me just cruise back to the base. Because I need to find one, I need some water actually. This thing can go down to 300 meters though now, which is interesting because we may need to go to that one. Let's just head back here. Um, make some coffee. Just. Cool. What else have we got in our inventory? Just lots of titanium. Ta, uh, awesome. Okay. Got to really stop pushing escape. I'm so used to, say, Minecraft controls, for example. And um, do I have my coffee? I lose my coffee. Thanks. Grab a few of these plants. Comes with liquid, it's not great, but. So that was something, oh, what did I put in here, anything? That was something I wanted to grab from those other places, wasn't it? Was the, um, was the trees that give you water. But let's, let's cruise to Can I see it? Yeah, you be quiet, you. It's a long way away, but... The thing we're in now can, can handle 300 metres. So if we cruise over to that spot, just check it out. I can't remember if I've been there, that's the problem. Here's another wreck. Can't tell if I've been to these anymore. I didn't I don't you know, I don't have a map, I don't I haven't kept a track of everywhere I've been. Just 
be smacking against the outside of the uh, craft. That one out. Special equipment required. Hey, what what um helmet am I wearing too? Yep, that's okay. That's the deep diving one. Somewhere down here. Obviously, we've got to be careful don't go below 300 because this thing will have a have an issue. There's a wreck here as well. Okay, so that's some sort of cavern. It's just a wreck we were at. This is a new one, so I've got my rebreather on. It's, I can only really jump outside for a short time. Moon pool. Uh, you use an oxygen like it's going out of fashion. Come on, what else have we got? Anything cool? We've really gotten too far away from my uh, the craft now. Let's go jump back. Yeah, I'm just gonna get stuffs. Well, another moon pool fragment. Good. Oh, that's awesome. That is something we um, that's something that is going to come in handy now. This potentially has stuff in it. So now that I've got some oxygen. Check around. Anything in crates? Uh, two. Come on. Recharger. Modification station here. Look, here we go. We're getting some bits now. Oh, the reinforced dive suit. That's helpful. Ah. Light stick. All right. Nothing else hovering up when I look around. Can't open that door. Get to run out of air. So let's jump back in the uh, seam off. So that's cool. We now have the ability to. Um, We've probably got too much junk in our inventory, but we now have the ability to build the moon pool. And what else did we get just then? So we got the reinforced dive suit, which we're going to need some diamonds for, which I think I've got a couple back at the base. Some sy synthetic fibers. Physical protection and enhanced survival in extreme temperatures. So that's good for deep, um, deep diving cold sort of thing. One light stick. 
Neptune launch platform. Prawn suit. Still trying to find the Cyclops. Moon pool. And that was pretty cheap. A couple of lead, some titanium, and some lubricant. And then. What was the other one? Got the modification station. Fantastic. Still need another power cell charger. One, and I'm kind of. Diversity in this region is unusually low. Cause unknown. interesting. Battery charger, power cell charger. There we got the battery charger. That's fine. Wherever that heat one was, the thermal plant. Rates heat to energy at medium efficiency. So I don't know if there's. I look another data pod. Prawn sort suit torpedo arm fragment. Yep. Just gonna get stuffs for that. Certainly got a few wins in this bit, which is very nice. Um, oh, there's my storage. Excellent. I can. Store the junk there. Very cool. I don't know whether that's a thing. Is that some? Five? No? So, I mean, potentially there's another. Yeah, potentially there's another piece or two around here that I could pick up. Whoops. Uh, there's a couple of pieces under here. Let's grab them. Oh, I'd love to grab one of them. Okay, so we just got a few more bits of titanium. There's lots of titanium on this planet. Okay, so we've got, oops, wow, things are not looking good for me, I'm out of here, don't even know where I'm going but I'm out of here, this thing is broken. Go up to the service. Maybe I can repair it. Things down there didn't like me. Okay, do I have two? Okay, so this one. Haha, <laughs> I can repair it. Well, that's better. Let's go. Oh no, I need water. Um, do I have any? Actually? Of course not. Of course not. Here's the life pod. And of course, it's ripped open. Not a big fan of doing this. New blueprint acquired. Grab this stuff. No idea what this. Whoa! New blueprint acquired. Seek fluid 
take immediately. Come on, get down. Go in here. Then a PDA. Signal location uploaded to PDA. Nice. Nothing else. Integrating new PDA data. Okay. I don't know what that stuff is. Rubies. Can I get it? Yeah. Right, cool. Nowhere to get what rubies from now. All right, I'm gonna get out of here. Before things get too bad. Get back to base and get some water. If I make it. Um, give me a few minutes to get back there. And I'll be back with you soon. Alright, I made it back to base, but uh, I died on the way. Um, yeah, them some breaks. I want to make the moon pool. Um, but to do that... Probably gonna take me going outside. I haven't really done this in a way that's gonna be helpful for me. Can we do a tube off this way. Gonna work. Apparently not. But off here. Come on. Come on. Um. Why that way? Oh, I've got no titanium. That, that's that's helpful. Um, whoops. So let's just jump back inside. Uh, got a fair bit during that time, so let's just grab as much titanium as I can for the moment, just so we can set something up. Because obviously we're going to need somewhere to put the moon pool. Um, so... Some sort of tube would be good. And you're not going to let me do that, are you? Why not? I can put it there. Alright, the moon pool. Um, how big is this thing? Okay, so it's too close, so I probably need... Okay, let's, let's do that and grab maybe another component. All strength now 3.5. Okay, I'm really struggling to work out how this is going to work. It says I can do it there, but how do I connect to it? Back in a second. Okay, so I finally got this thing to um, connect Welcome up. Aboard, but just for the sake of making sure that my uh, habitat is strong, I've been adding a few reinforcement plates onto the uh, onto the habitat. So we're now up at 20, which is good. I was, I was getting fairly low. I do need to probably make a little bit more in the way of power generation, but for the moment, um, yeah, I got this other message while I was trying to do stuff with um, this one here. After weeks without human contact, it is normal to experience psychological discomfort. Research indicates symptoms may be partly alleviated by adopting a pet or anthropomorphizing an inanimate object. So it wants me to get a, uh, uh, a volleyball like in uh, Castaway. Um, but yeah, so I tried a few things and then eventually managed to get this. That's that one thing I added on. This isn't exactly 
in a great spot now. So I probably need to deconstruct this, which is unfortunate. Do I have enough room? Probably not. So not quite ideal. Where's indoor grow bed? I can make arrow gel now, which is inter interesting. Uh, vehicle upgrade console, we can make that. We need copper chip. A computer chip and copper wire, but and the modification station, we're going to need a few things for. I'm going to put this back in though, and I lost everything that was planted in it, which is unfortunate. Uh, let's see what's in here. Uh, I'm probably going to have to go and find more stuff to put in there which I'm going to do in between episodes that's fine I'll go back to that uh, back to the plant uh, back to the the area and um, try and get another tree or two uh, so modification stations going to require lead diamond titanium and computer chip battery charger we can now make radios we can Vehicle upgrade console will be cool. Build in the moon pool to upgrade docked vehicles. So three titanium, a computer chip, and a copper wire. Let's see if we've got the stuff for it. Just to finish off this episode, I think we're getting oops, I think we're getting near the end. Let's put that away. So what do we need? We need computer chip, copper wire, gold, and table coral couple of copper ores, so we're going to need at least four copper. Mm, there's one table coral. I think we may not be able to do this because I may not have what I need, but let's try it. Couple wire. I need to make, need to go and get some table coral. Okay, let's do that. Remember if I put some... No, I didn't. Table coral over here. Okay. Uh, I might need another computer chip or two, so let's just... Okay, uh, two, four, five, let's grab one more. Hey, get, get back here. All right. You know what I want to do. Welcome aboard, Captain. Oh, nice. Very cool. Okay. Head back over here. Computer chip. And what else did I need? Copper wire and three titanium. Okay, so let's make one more copper wire. Okay, there's the three titanium. Let's go make this thing. Okay. Paint it. Change its name. Change its paint colour. <laughs> That's pretty cool. And then vehicle upgrade console. Ah, here we go. So we can do hull reinforcements. So titanium, lithium, and diamonds. Engine efficiency. 
I don't know how to make the poly polyanine lean stuff. We've already got a storage module on it, but it's got storage modules. So CMOS stuff, we can do depth module mark one, which it's got. Solar charge, which is pretty cool. Perimeter defense system, very nice. The T torpedo says uh, that's that's great. I can probably standard payload system fire torpedoes and sonar. We need the magnetite. I don't have magnetite yet. Here's all our updates for prawn suit. And then how to make torpedoes. So I guess these are the two torpedoes that we know at the moment until we get torpedoes. I don't know where we get gas pods from. Probably those big floating creatures. The the um, ones that fire the... I don't know. The things that are floating around the base with a little gas ball on the end of them. Maybe we can work something out. Alright, so for the moment, I think I'm going to wrap up here. We now have this lovely base area or moon pool for our Seamoth or Prawn Suit or whatever we get next. Um, I do have the ability to make the Prawn Suit, but um, that's probably going to require some materials I don't quite have at the moment. Um, I wouldn't mind trying to get a modification station made, so I'll see if I've got the materials I need for that. I don't think I do. And I'm going to go to the other, back to one of those uh, islands, probably the one, uh, yeah, probably the one that's this side. So yeah, it's not time out there, uh, with the three bases on it, and we'll, we'll record from there next time. But thank you all for watching. Please leave your comments in the section below. I hope you come back and join me next time. Bye now.